Watermelon Madness by T uh, Tagri Najjar, illustrated by Maya Fidawi. Nora is a little girl who loves to eat watermelon. She eats watermelon in the morning. She eats watermelon in the afternoon. She eats watermelon in the evening. One day, Nora uh, sat down to eat with her family. Mama scooped a uh, mokihaya with chicken and rice onto her Nora's plate. Nora's plate, but N Nora turned up her nose. I don't like mo uh, molokihaya. I don't like chicken. I only want watermelon. Chicken is good for you, Nor uh, Nora, Baba insisted. And mo uh, molokihaya is yummy. Nora, uh, Nora roared. Watermelon, watermelon. I only want watermelon. Mama was very angry and said, First, you can eat your mo molokihaya. Then you can have watermelon. That evening, Nora and Nora snuck into the kitchen and saw a big watermelon on the table. She stood there and thought, "Yum! That is, that is a very big watermelon. I want to I want to eat it all by myself. All by myself." Nora took the watermelon and rolled it uh, rolled it under her bed so that she could eat it after everyone ha had gone to sleep. She fell asleep thinking about the big watermelon under her bed. In the middle of the night, Nora felt her bed shaking. She opened her eyes and saw the watermelon growing bigger and bigger and bigger and got so big that her bed almost touched the ceiling. Nora, uh, Nora slid down the watermelon. Wee, wee, I'm so happy, I'm so happy. This whole watermelon is for me. Nora, Nora walked inside the wall, watermelon and found a door on its side. She opened the door and went inside the watermelon. She walked down a, a long hallway until she we, reached a bright pink room. Inside were a table and a chair and water uh, and, uh, and made out of watermelon seeds. Nora sat at the table. I'm so happy. I'm so happy. This whole watermelon is all for me. Nora ate her first piece of watermelon. Yum. This watermelon is so delicious. I want more. And another piece of watermelon appeared right in front of her. Nora kept eating and eating and eating. And she kept saying, I want more. And I want more. The moment she finished a piece of watermelon, another one will appear in its appear in its plate. And suddenly, Nora stopped eating. She felt herself getting bigger and bigger and bigger as the watermelon got smaller and smaller. Nora grabbed her belly and cried, "Ow, ow, ow! My tummy hurts anymore. I don't want any more." And Nora opened her eyes and found Mama sitting next to her and patting her. What's wrong, Nora? What's the matter? There was a giant watermelon under my bed, and it ate so much of me, like a, a, a of it, and it ate so much of it, I felt like it swallowed me. Mama took the watermelon out of, of out from Nora, under Nora's bed. Who put this watermelon under your bed, Nora? Nora felt embarrassed. I did. I'm sorry, Mama. I wanted to eat the. I wanted to eat the whole watermelon all by myself, but it. But it, I got started getting bigger and bigger. Watermelon got smaller and smaller. Mama smiled. Get back to sleep now, Nora. We'll talk about the. Uh, we'll talk about the magic watermelon tomorrow. Nora turned her over and in her bed and, and fell asleep right away. And the next morning at at breakfast. Nora ate her fried egg and za'atar with olive oil and drank all her milk. Fun fact about watermelon. Watermelons are or uh, originally came from Africa. They're related to cu cucumbers. The rind and seeds can be eaten. Some, ver uh, some ver uh, very, uh, uh, very ties have a uh, yellow flesh. Uh, I hope you enjoyed this video. Subscribe to my channel for more videos. Goodbye until next time.